In this video, I'm gonna go over a really simple mistake you're gonna to wanna to avoid making when working with pivot tables. In this data set, I've got dates, vendors, and amounts. And my dates go from 2024 all the way until 2025. Now, the problem is my pivot table is only broken out by months. And so when I look at January, I might assume that includes values for one month. However, if I open that up to see what's in there, I can see values for both January 2024 and January 2025. This is an easy mistake to make, especially when you're updating a table and including values for a new year. If you haven't broken out by a year, you could be including amounts for multiple months. To fix this, go to your pivot table and add the years grouping so that your pivot table is separated out by month and year. You'll want to put this field above your month's breakdown just to ensure you see the year and then the month. This way, you can be sure you're only looking at one month even if you have multiple years in your data set. For more tips like this, check out howtoexcel.net and my YouTube channel, at H2E.